The words I can't are it's just an excuse for giving up. Ever since I was a kid, people always doubted what I could do. I think limits are just meant to be overcome. Jessica is most famous for being the first armless pilot in aviation history to fly using only their feet. She also has an unrestricted driver's license. She's a certified scuba diver. She has a bachelor's degree in psychology. She's a third degree black belt in Taekwondo and certified trainer. She's pretty unstoppable. When people see me, they immediately look at the fact that I don't have arms. And I think there's a parallel with the way people see challenges. They immediately see either the difficulty or the impossibility. We're actually early for once. <laughs> I never felt pity for myself. That was one thing I never did. I felt angry and I felt frustrated about my birth condition. There wasn't a specific moment for me when it turned from being an angry, frustrated girl to a woman with confidence. It was just a journey. It was little things that happened along the way. Uh, the first day of eighth grade, I was 14, and I decided to give up my fake arms, which I wore to school for 11 years. But the moment I made that decision to leave them behind and finally accept who I am, that for me was a huge step to understand that it's, it's not about how people respond to me, it's how I carry myself. There's something I want to do. I don't think about the process. I think of the end result. She's constantly adapting and finding new ways to do things. As early as I can remember, I've had to prove myself. It's something I'm prepared to do. Over, through, and Pull to tighten. And just like that, I tied my shoes after a couple hundred tries, figured out the importance of thinking outside the shoe. From the moment she was born at the hospital, I'll say it like this, her little round eyes would just look like she's gonna attack the world, you know? And she had been attacking it ever since. Some of the things in my life and challenges I've had to fight for. As a result of the doubt that remains in people's minds as to whether I can safely and appropriately conduct myself in the way that people in a two-handed world would. I had to fight to have an unrestricted driver's license because I wanted to drive an unmodified vehicle. I have to have the ability to just pick up a rental car anywhere because during my speaking engagements, I'm in cities all over the world. There are encounters that I have with people in the public who aren't always comfortable with someone who's different. And I use it as an opportunity to show them that it's okay to be different, and everyone's different, and we just have to be confident in our differences. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Jessica is there to constantly be a reminder of don't let assumptions of people who don't okay. understand what you're capable of hold you back. If I hear people use the words, I can't, I like to remind them that those words will limit you. If you can stop yourself from saying those words, you would be surprised at what's possible.